Hi, what's up guys? Today I would like to show you my Red Dragon Edge Fiend deck profile. So let's start with the main deck. I play 3 Soul Resonator. This is the new searcher of the deck. And it has a protection effect from Grave. Next to Vision Resonator. This card can uh, search a spell or trap that mentions Red Dragon Edge Fiend. And also you can special summon it uh, if you control Dark uh, monster that is uh, level 5 or higher. Uh, 3 Crimson Resonator, so you can uh, special summon 2 Resonator monsters with this card if you control only one Dark Dragon Synchro monster. Next, uh, 2 Synchro Resonator and 1 Chain Resonator. These are the level 1 Resonators. Uh, you want to uh, play uh, two Synchron Resonator because it's a really powerful follow-up with the Red Rising Dragon because uh, you can banish this card from Grave and special summon two level 1 Resonators from uh, Grave. And uh, this card doesn't have a uh, hard advance per turn, so if this card is sent to the Grave, uh, you can add back a Resonator from your Grave. And Chain Resonator uh, is not included in the Structure deck, so if you want to build this deck, I recommend you to uh, get this card, because it's a real good normal summon. Next, for the non-tuners, 3 Bone Arch Wind and 2 Wandering King Wild Wind. So, the, uh, I only play 5, five of these and uh, it's not really a problem for this deck because uh, the deck has a lot of uh, searchers and uh, these cards are uh, your extenders uh, Wandering King Wild Wind can be special summoned if you control uh, Fiend Tuner and uh, Bone Arch Fiend can be special summoned by the special summon from Hand or Grave by sending a, a card to Grave and also it can dump uh, Fiend Tuner from your deck to Grave and uh, level modulate by uh, 1. And uh, Wandering King One Wind can be banished uh, from Grave to search a, a Fiend Tuner, but you cannot activate it the same turn it was sent to Grave. But it's a really good uh, follow up because uh, during most of your combos you end on uh, lit small number of cards in hand or uh, even without cards in hand. Next, three Sopei and uh, Sopei Duskwalker and one Sopei. So uh, with this card you can uh, discard a card and special summon Sopei from uh, deck and uh, with this combo you can make a level 6 synchro. Next, uh, one uh, obesive wallop. Uh, so this card uh, is a really unique effect that uh, you can uh, target a uh, one synchro monster from your uh, field or grave, banish it, and you can special summon it from uh, hand. And you can uh, also it has a grave effect that you can uh, banish a. Synchro monster from field or grave and add it back to your hand. So this card is uh, really good with uh, combination with this pattern. So you want to banish your uh, synchros and special summon them back with this pattern. Next uh, for spells, three Crimson Gaia and three Resonator Call. These are the searcher searchers of the deck. And uh, for the traps, one red zone, so this is the new trap card that has a uh, destruction effect. Next, for the going second cards, three Kashtera Fenrir, so this is a uh, beat stick, it's a mm, uh, interruption and also it has a a free, it's a special free special summon. Gets your card on to the, your hand, and also it's a level seven monster. So you can use this card with uh, different monsters that you can go into level eight or level ten synchros. 
next for the hand traps three ash three imperm two ghost mourner and two nibiru and that's it for the main deck for the extra i play three red rising dragon so you want to abuse this card as much as possible because it's really powerful next one uh, koi belt the blade dragon so this is the level 7 synchro that uh, you can play because it's a dark dragon and it has a pretty good effect that uh, if you are going second uh, you can break both trees next the new uh, scarlet dragon archfiend uh, this card, if this card is uh, used as a synchro material, you can uh, special summon the red dragon archfiend and also you can uh, pop your opponent's uh, monsters. Next one, uh, Scarlight red dragon archfiend. You can clear uh, fields with this card. One, uh, void of red dragon. So this is the uh, spell trap negate because uh, you can only use this card if you don't control any cards in hand, but it's uh, pretty common to don't have any cards in hand uh, during the hand phase. Next two hot dragon, uh, hot red dragon archwind abyss and one bane, one red nova dragon one red supernova dragon so these are the different boss monsters of this deck and uh, level 10 synchros one uh, bestial dispater and one burn the floor and that's it for the deck profile let me know in the comments what do you think about this deck what would you change and what other deck profiles would like to see thanks for watching and see you next time